AI. Um, yeah, let's finish this, uh, this proposition. We want to set new AI. Um, like, let me show you new AI for first best. And uh, so I want to keep the proposition in the same format as our proposition for optimal welfare and optimal revenue. And then the proof the same format too, so something like this. So we said new AI is this amount. However, I want to make my new AI look like the new AI of um, first best so the comparison is easier mm. new ai First best. So this is it. This is the format. is we solve this linear using this t mu theta i plus s omega as Okay, mu AI in first best will be mu of this, right? And let's assume that we have symmetric case. Therefore, theta J and theta I have the same mu will be mu theta. So our mu AI will be S mu omega over 1 minus n minus 1 to r plus um, can you see this? what are you looking at it here? You. okay so it will be s mu omega 1 minus n minus 1 to r and those who have common de denominator 1 plus 2 r 1 minus n minus 1 to r and we have 1 minus n minus 2 to r t mu theta i plus 2 r t n minus 1 mu theta i right so t mu theta i 
will have Tinju theta i Tinju theta i Tinju theta i Tinju theta i And um, Actually, one plus two are right, two are we have one plus two R, which will cancel out with one plus two R in the denominator. Is it magic? Why is that? So now they have the same denominator and it will be this mu omega plus t mu theta i over 1 minus n minus 1 to r. So this mu omega t mu theta i 1 minus n minus 1 to r. And now the difference here is that this negative sign here and I have to make it like Over. Okay. Over the minus. This is it. So I want to have it here minus. We want to remove this part. We want to take. Also, we want to remove two. So fuck this part. Uh huh. We want to. We want to, we want to, where is the left? Uh, uh, okay, I should also, fuck, all right, uh, minus two, control x, here, control v, and then, Let's see how it looks. Oh, it's here, by the way. So, let's see. Let me see if I. That's better, right? This one here. This one here. We have no overlap. All right. Um, so that's it. Um,
Okay, yeah, this looks like this, which is easier to compare. Now, let's also start from now on, instead of writing sigma a theta i, let's start writing everything based on sigma a theta i over t sigma theta i squared. So it should be minus one, right? Right. Even though I don't like it much, it will be a pain in the ass. Everywhere writing it based on sigma i and theta i. You know what? Let's not do it. Let's really not do it. And if necessary, we will do it at the end. Like, we will write the whole paper and at the end, focus on writing it later. Um, so that's it. When players follow their action recommendation for r in minus one half and one over two n minus one, there exists a unique symmetric truthful mechanism maximizing revenue. This mechanism, the recommended actions are deterministic given theta and omega, hence AI um, where is hence? Hence, okay, AI is this, where mu AI is this, and okay, now we want to talk about sigmas. Um, where sigma AI theta I is a for example, equation, uh, solution, root of this, like, degree three equation. For example, R and U. Wait, why don't we have sigma i i theta i greater than? Yeah. Oh, we have it. Okay. So we have them here. Now we want to describe sigma i i theta i is a final solution to that. Mu a i is already based on this sigma i omega. Maybe we can add sigma i omega right here, right? For some delta. No, we're writing F to actually F. If 25 is satisfied. So, yes. Where this? Uh, I also want to see how is the environment here. I think it's a. Uh, oh, gather. Environment is called gather. Begin in new memory. Begin gather. Um, solution revenue. And we are separating by backslashes and comma. Right. Let's do this where I used a line, I guess. What did I use? Where uh, All right, so we use gather instead. Um, yeah, because we are inside the proposition. Uh, 
also Now, what is our sigma i theta i? What is it? So, where? Let's maybe open a new one. Do. same time in three web pages parallel working serial working consistently working that's it that's difficult shit this is no easy shit scrolling up and down to find the formula yeah My eyes are getting red. I have to go to the bed. Where is it? Show yourself, motherfucker, Sigma I Omega. Let's start with it. Do we have Sigma I Omega? Yeah, A, J. Yeah, Theta Omega, Theta I, Theta J. So we don't need to talk about, well, here. Here he doesn't talk about Sigma I Omega, uh, A, I squared, and Sigma I, A, J, because we have their value already. Um, based on obedience constraint. In our case, we can find out sigma a, a, a j and a i a squared, um, not, because, not because of obedience, but because our PSD constraints, our PSD constraints are binding. Therefore, once you have, so we have sigma a omega, we have sigma i theta j based on theta i. All right, this is all good, no problemo. But, okay, let me see. Sigma a i theta i, sigma a i theta j, sigma a i omega, nu. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Okay. We have two constraints. We use the Lagrangian um, by just by writing. It's not KKT. It is derivation. All right. It should be zero. It should be zero. It should be zero. We find nu. We find we find lambda. We find sigma i omega, we find sigma i theta i and sigma i theta j. But I am not writing anything about sigma i squared. 
and sigma. Okay, the thing is that, okay, it's again about binding. Lambda and nu are positive. Um, so we can compute sigma i take uh, the thing is, is if I want to write them here for now that we don't I say from a practical point of view for now that I don't have the formula for them let's just say they will be they can be computed based on and then later I will show. Right, let's do that. So where is this? Uh, next line. What what do I want to talk about? Sigma AI theta J probably. Not here. Oh. New AI Sigma AI Omega R. Oh, we already used gathered, all right. Um, Sigma. AI theta um, J, I like to write it too. Should I also say when we say they are deterministic? It means our PST constraint is binding. So, but once PST is binding, well, all right, uh, is being deterministic different in the obedient case and the non obedient case? In the obedience situation, we already had sigma ai squared and sigma ai aj based on the other parameters. Um, yeah. So there is this difference, so I don't know what's up. Um, sigma, what was that? Wait a minute. Um, um, Yep, I want this one. Um, control C. V and let's see how 
blobs. What is thirty-eight then? Um, Um, so we have Okay, I will add it here Say since PSD constraints are binding bind and we can compute Push PSC constraint point, and we have uh, okay. I want to find the formula therefore. Okay, I also have to write sigma i theta i is the root to a degree 3 equation somewhere. Um, either I want to say this is it, not adding sigma i squared and sigma i j for now. Writing that sigma i theta i is the solution to this degree three equation, and uh, and it is enough, right? Because by the way, for formula for a i, we don't have any. Yes, one of the reason we don't mention sigma i squared and sigma i a j is that in the formula for a i, they don't show up, so there is no need for that actually. Um, so I can say sigma i theta i, the other parameters are defined based on sigma i theta i, now I say sigma i theta i is the unique solution to this degree 3 equation, and it is done at the uh, end, I can add a corollary or something, that okay, our constraints are binding because Lagrangian multipliers are positive, and uh, they are positive, they are binding, therefore, therefore, therefore sigma i theta i, sigma a i theta i, and sigma i, no, sigma i squared and sigma a i a j can be computed based on 
Sigma A Theta I Thank you Thank you Alright So I don't want to write it here I feel it's better Doesn't hurt our Proposition at all And Well, this dollar sign sigma a i theta i is is the unique Ooh. Ooh. is the unique mm, solution real solution because every degree three equation has three solutions all the time but here we have the situation there is only one real one and it is the unique real solution oh to the equation dude I'm getting good the following equation All right. what is the equation by the way do 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 We also, I also have to show that the solution is unique and real. Create order for inner. What was that? Um, sigma AI theta I is the unique real solution to the. Sounds good. Look at my fucking proposition. Half of a page. And just formulas. I hate this proposition. It's not mathematically. Satisfying. And. It's just big. Having no intuition behind it and not practical it is called an armchair proposition mental masturbation all right um so that's it all right i say
I say let's start. <laughs> the proof. Well, let's look if the proof proof is not inside the proposition, right? Proof. Pro begin proof and proof. So So this positive part and being unbounded, we don't need it. We just want to say for uh, R inside the interval, This is stuff I don't want to keep them here. Uh. Actually, just deleting in them doesn't cost me much. If we need them later, I can do the computation again and let me see how much time we spent. Okay, we will go for 20 more minutes. Um, so all of this I can delete. When the, let's, let's for now keep them. Um, Indent order order and order keeps you creative. All right, this is it. So these are all bullshit as well. I will change it to for R. We have it's just a matter of taste, so who cares for now? For R, uh, 
are in minus frac and frac one two and minus one. The objective function objective is concave in mirror AI. Do you think I should put all of this together? It's concave in mu AI. What are we saying next? I like this. I like this. Yeah. Since me I is unconstrained, come on. The optimum or optimal amount for it comes from from this we have again I want to write okay Resultant Wait, what? Suddenly a lot of errors came at me. Do do do. Actually, I can just reference to the equation in the propositions. Who cares? Let's have it like that here.
problem changes to can say resulting in okay now the optimization problem changes to now come on take some time man you just solve an equation when you say now you need to have a pause now the optimization problem changes to What the fuck is this? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Or why are, we, why are we saying or? Oh, which one do you want to choose? We can remove one of these. Yeah, I want it. That's it. Also, I don't like I don't like the term F because we have it, you can see it here, we have F here in another proposition as this ratio. Uh, and it's a global variable here, I feel. So better we have another local term. This is this okay? Um, this the rational term of the objective, objective function is concave. I don't want to call it f. Uh, term or part. in the objective function by the way if you are a mathematician you may say oh the rational term in the object is it well defined because this is not obvious and that is i want to say fuck you you're just dumb um, f sigma i theta i yeah, I understand that you understand mathematics and it's not, it may not be unique and da 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 and it's a function, it's not something, some characters on the do 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 page, but come on dog, why are you so mean? I am the nicest motherfucker, what are you talking about? Um... is concave, the quadratic part is concave as well. Therefore, the whole objective is concave. Sounds good, right? The rational term and objective function, okay, we don't want to call it F, that was something. Okay, what do you want to call it? Just some Greek shit. Eta. Who cares? Part, I want to say, tear. is concave as well, therefore the whole objective is concave. Oh, 
Uh -huh. What if I use it as a display mask? Like this is this inline writing it doesn't look good to be honest. Do -do -do -do. Again, display mask. Concave Right, that looks much better The quadratic term As well, therefore the whole objective is concave We introduce Non-negative Nagrange multipliers Lambda and Nu For the first and second inequality construct respectively all right introduce them and look for a solution to the kkt condition is it the same here we introduce i feel it should be in the course exactly i'm so so good at copy and pasting um, the stationary condition yields the following system. All right. Sounds good. Um, here I want to add the proposition. Wait, where is the proof? Begin proof, where, where is it? Oh my god! Okay. Oh, we should bring all of them inside the proof. To where? I thought I don't get for the value. Rational term in the objective function. Control V All right, looks good. Right. Do not hunch, do not hunch, keep your head up, do not hunch. I wanna say proof. Okay, I don't want, I don't, uh, I don't like this, I don't like this. And I want. 
want to also say here instead of following equations dot instead of comma. Am I right or am I wrong? Who knows? Thibaut. Thibaut knows if I'm right or wrong. Um, do you think it's right? Do you think like adding a comma or like period or should matter when you're writing a paper which is like very theoretical? You think I've sometimes actually not sometimes all the times I'm feeling that these are just waste of time for me but let's be honest if which is a big if there is a writing if there is a reader who is going to read this we don't want them to be mentally mentally paralyzed by our writing so yeah we already have all the solutions but there is somebody else on the other side who wants to read this so we want to write them in a way that they can read nice and well and they they can this is our product right we want it to look good so other people already it is huge this this paper like he, as you can see it has like long nasty equations and if a reader is interested we want them to be comfortable reading it, not getting into unnecessary troubles. Therefore, we have to edit. If it was a homework for me and a TA was real, uh, yeah, I think there is a difference between under, like when I was in undergrad or when I whenever I had courses. If it was my homework, I would just submit it, and it was it. It was up to the TA. Or the teacher to find the solution and check if it is right but now it's a reader it has a reader we don't want them to well if a reader is really interested but it's really difficult like i read papers even when they are uh, polished and writers put a lot of times reading a paper is far more difficult than reading a book because I don't know, even like, yeah, they polish the books. But the thing is that for books, like mathematical books, right? Uh, there is this, they have more time or like more space to break the theorems in smaller steps so that you have lemmas, you have theorems, but each step is pretty clear. And But in papers, it's just, very difficult so as the writer or other you have to um, be observant of your readers write it write your paper even though the part that sucks the most for me is that I'm sure no fucking body will read this paper at least they won't go to the proofs and if they go they are fucking dumb so yeah there is ups and downs you want to be nice to your readers who knows? We write our papers. Maybe every fucking mental masturbator on earth wants to read this paper. Okay. Um, the stationary condition yields the following system of equation. This is it. And... Okay, now I want to also mention that my nu and my lambda are positive. Therefore, my when I uh, state my corollary, we know that they're binding. The PSD is binding. Sigma i omega, we have it. Sigma i theta j, we have it. And Wait, isn't it like even the degree three equation comes from this? 
But everything comes from this. So I don't even know. Like it is done. It's end of it. I can say which leads to equation 36, 37. And 30 uh, fucking 8 and also lambda nu yeah sounds right sounds right yeah the stationary condition yields the following system of equations I say it is it makes sense um, from the migration uh, I want to say we have from above we have How can I? Well, definitely, it doesn't work like that. Just can I just uh I put I should put a label for this gather. However, it doesn't really matter. It's just because new AI's value cannot uh Mu AI's value is just computed based on a separate formula. If I refer to the gather, it will refer to the whole. Let's 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 do that and see how it works. Um, oh, wait, how? Uh, why do we have? Number separate numbers here for each what here when I use gather gathered ah oh, oh oh and is inside an align star so that's what's up. But here we have, I have gather, it's also the same here, right? Equation 
all of them. So here he just has one label for the whole equation and inside the equation we have gathered I feel like I have what is here I just mentioned gather doesn't work I can put it inside an equation oh that's disgusting by the way or I can just separate new AI from the rest Because I want to separate them separately. Yeah, let's do that another time. Um, yeah, it has been an hour. So, next time. Thank you. Control Shift A.